Everything in life is a mind game. Whenever we get swept under by life's dramas, large and small, we are forgetting that no matter how bad the pain gets, no matter how harrowing the torture, all bad things end. Finding moments of laughter in the pain and delirium turned the entire melodramatic experience upside down for us. It gave us some control of our emotions. Again, this was all a mind game. Yeah, so we got the new Honey Night Quill. It's a new flavor. Um, and hold on, I'll show you. New Honey Night Quill. And um, it's really good, actually. It doesn't taste very good. But, like, you know how you take Night Quill and it tastes disgusting? Um, when you taste. When you take this, it tastes disgusting, but it tastes disgusting for a shorter amount of time. So I would actually get this over the cherry nightclub. Here's our messy apartment. We just got home and uh, road trip was great. Shay, how do you feel? I feel still sick. Don't look, nobody judge my crooked glasses, but um, I feel sick and um, just been resting all day. And now we have go work out outside. So I'm really excited to do that right now. And I just see my new jacket. James went into the store to get me NyQuil and he came out with this new friends jacket. Yeah, she's a sick girl. So I thought that <laughs> she wanted a cool sweater. Cause who doesn't want to be all cozy when you're all sick? You know what I'm saying? Also, this has got to go. Am I right, Shay? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know who said that looks good. Just kidding. So yeah, we're gonna go on a walk right now, come back, do an indoor workout, finish all of our water. I have two of these to drink still, so I still have a whole freaking gallon. So, <laughs> okay. It's 8.09, so we've got about, we haven't told, I don't know. I wanna to go to bed at like midnight. Yeah, me too, midnight, midnight's the goal. So, We'll see how it goes today. Anyways, got a lot to catch up on. Tomorrow should be a lot better. I know you can't see us, but um, it is freezing out here. We're, we're definitely not in AZ, but that's for sure. So we're gonna run back inside for two seconds. I'm gonna get my big puffy jacket. Probably change my socks. You gonna get anything? A beanie, priory gloves, the works. And we'll finish this workout. Two minutes in, looking did great. You, did you know that um, I just got a call that asked to put me on Vogue? Oh, really? Yeah, I said, not right now. I'm busy with my husband, so you're my priority right now. Oh, look that at that. That looks so good on you. I know. <laughs> you have like a horn in the back of your head. <laughs> We got it at Walmart last year. Oh, maybe Vogue called me for you. Maybe that's what happened. No. Not at all. I'm wearing blue joggers, blue hoodie, some blue socks. Um, on the weather app, it says that it's gonna snow here in a couple minutes. Snowstorms here, uh, a couple flurries in Lehigh City. Uh, Dan Johnson, I'm uh, it's on here now. I don't think it's gonna snow. That's what it says. Um, I don't think it's going to though. Well, it's cold enough where it could start snowing. <laughs> this is crazy because Jay is sick. It's ice cold out here, but to complete the challenge, still, she's so awesome. She's still out here walking. The she wants to complete the challenge, but she's sick. And that's crazy. I feel like if I was thinking, like, hey, babe, let's like restart the challenge, maybe. I definitely thought about quitting today. I okay. definitely thought about quitting. As soon as we 
came back to our basement apartment, I was like, I think we should be done. I know. Like, I'm but so also, this is like my first full day off in forever, and we were in the car for still four hours. Yeah, so it's still good to get out and walk. It is yeah. Crazy, but we did get our jackets, and we are a lot warmer now. But yeah, after this, we go inside, we're going to do a workout, read our books, do all those things. Maybe watch a movie, stay on our diet. That's the other thing. I'm a firm believer when you're sick to exercise after fitness, depending on how you're feeling. I feel really sick, so I don't, well, I don't want to exercise at all right now, but I should. But also, when I'm sick, I like to eat junk food, straight junk food, which I know probably isn't the best for you. bag of Doritos tonight, so I'm a little bummed, so I'm trying to be creative with what I can eat. Okay. Huh. I think I still picked up my head. I don't think you're right. No, I'm not kidding. No, you're, you're, you're wrong. So we're just getting back. We opened a couple of packages that we missed out on. And what did you get from work? This is the sweetest thing ever. Is I got this awesome. I wasn't. I didn't know this was coming, but I just started this new job, kind of. And they sent me a package. Like no idea what it is. And it's like this like interesting shape too, right? Oh my gosh, look at all of that. It's all chocolate. And like I said, we don't talk a lot about our diets, but we don't eat sweets. Neither one of us, me or James, don't eat sweets. So, oh my gosh, that smells... So, also, here's my dinner. Just kidding. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, there's my corn and my chicken and my beans. And this just smells so good. So we'll save this and eat this in May, I guess. But it's fun to smell. 